Hi, Graham Vincent, violin maker. Um, I've got two violins here, which I'm going to be putting up on my shop today. The first one is an Ash one, um, and it's, what is it? Number 36, which was, um, I think was 2022. Yeah, towards the end of 2022. And this one is a a limewood violin made this year, early this year. Um, the reason I made one in such a limewood, which is rather an unusual move, it has to be said, was I was experimenting with trying to make the lightest possible violin I can, and this really came in light. It's, um, I think, 300, and, well, it's around about the 350 gram mark anyway, which puts it right at the bottom end of where Del Ye Yezu was, and he's, he's renowned for his um, light violins. Uh, I made two of them, um, two different types of reclaimed wood on the front. The other one had um, a really, really interesting and pleasing sound. This one's got a pleasing sound, but it's quite different. It's, in some regards, it's almost like the, the treble has been turned right down, which makes it a really nice violin for nice, quiet, intimate playing. It's, it's the perfect violin for sitting in front of the fire with, I think. Um, but for the purposes of this, um, it's also, I think, a very good violin for recording, um, because you know what it's like. Um, you're trying to record a violin and you get so much treble. I mean, I've just got this set up with the, um, the iPhone is literally at arm's length. Um, standard my usual violin both violins have got the same set of strings on i'm using um a fairly typical bow oh, which has just had a repair done on the tip where it's split it's my my favorite bow i think this one nice old um i believe it's probably german pernambuco bow from uh the 19th century So that, I mean, that sounds great to me, sounds great to people in the room listening, um, probably sounds quite harsh when recorded. It's gonna be very interesting playing this back and hearing that. So that's the, that's the Limewood one. Um, back to the, back to the Ash one. That's uh, William and Nancy, it's an old English folk tune. Not sure I've played it 100% correct. That's the same one on the um, Limewood violin.
Yeah, so I mean, to me here, that sounds absolutely beautiful, lovely tone, everything. But of course, like I say, recording violins is a bit of a bit of a pig, really. So this one, which again sounds lovely to me here, but I, I'm, I'm aware that it's kind of muffled is completely the wrong word because it has treble there. But I, but it's it's kind of a, a warm, comforting kind of softer sound, so which would be ideal in front of the fireplace of an evening. So, but. Both of them are lovely to play. Uh, anyway, yeah, they'll both be up on the um, on the shop this afternoon. Um, so let me know what you think. Look after yourselves. Cheers, folks. Bye.